no, no, you will never see him on Facebook. Otherwise, I'll wait to hear from you because I want you to be able to get back to you. Do you want to go pro today? Yeah, yeah. I know you. Good morning, y'all. Today, we're doing a group hike with our friend Steve Oliphant on the North Ridge Trail in Oak Ridge. I know I talked about this in one of my previous videos that we will be doing this group hike. So we're out today um, with some of our other hiker friends and we're looking to do a eight mile hike today. And uh, you can do this hike as an out and back for 16 miles, but we're just gonna do from point to point for eight miles. So, uh, looking forward to it. Uh, I don't believe we've done any of this trail. I think the trail we did before was part of this trail, so this is all new for us. Um, so, anyway, let's get started. I would love to get a picture because I think this is the biggest hike that's ever hiked here. If this is our inaugural uh, Secret City hikes on the Northridge Trail, so I'll explain the history of the Northridge Trail once we get a picture. Okay, so let me explain a little bit. There's a four, an eight, and a 16 mile option. So the four mile option, we've got a drop car there. So if after four miles, you've had enough. Um, Lisa will probably everybody keep walking if you're doing fine, but after four miles, you can we can bring you back to here. And if Lisa's doing great, she might keep going too. So we'll see. So, so if this this is not an easy trail. <laughs> this is this is about as hard as like going to Charlie's Bunyan or, or walking on the Appalachian Trail. So don't go real. It'll be slick today. It did rain yesterday. So the history of this trail is you'll see there's two signs here. It's this is both a National Recreation Trail and a Tennessee Recreation Trail. The National Recreation Trail was um, designated as one of the first in East Tennessee in, in the early 1970s. And the importance of that is, is that's pretty much an irreversible designation. Once you have a National Recreation Trail, that's an act of Congress, it really is. To, to ever make this land anything but a trail would take another act of Congress, which isn't going to happen. That's like reversing a national park. <laughs> mm -hmm. So this was a big deal for the city of Oak Ridge in the early 70s. When this was designated a National Recreation Trail, it became off limits to develop. It was the end of having houses or subdivisions in this this 20 mile section here between here and the valley and Oak Ridge hasn't changed a whole lot since then because we preserved 85 miles of hiking trails around this city right now it's a very unique city so that's what we're going to be hiking on today kind of the concept of preserving these woods like this right here next to where people live it's also a Tennessee recreation trail for the first four miles between here and Key Springs Road what that means is you get grant money to uh, have chainsaws and come in here and cut the trees and put and make it a nice trail. So between here and Key Springs Road, it's a little bit nicer. The last four miles is pretty rugged because you don't have near as much maintenance there. So just everybody knows what they're getting into there. Okay, so any questions before we get started? Okay, so I'm just going to start and I'll stop, you know, for every 10, 15 minutes or so, make sure everybody's doing okay. I think we'll have some nice wildfires. I know. Oh, look, Steve. Have the mountain view. What, is, what is that flower? That's a red bud tree. Oh, cool. This is like the red bud capital of Tennessee. We oh, should man. see a ton of them. Down oh, there. good. Yeah. It's a red bud tree. Yeah, you don't see them as much in the Alright, so we went kind of sort of off trail for a second just to get this really pretty mountain view. So, let me show you. Very nice. <laughs> One of the best things I think of this whole trail that we're going to see all day long is a view of the Cumberland Mountains. And we see all the way from Brushy Mountain. If you've ever heard of Brushy Mountain State Penitentiary, yep. we cross Tennessee. Mm -hmm. okay, that's over there to that side, <laughs> all the way in that direction in Wartburg, Tennessee there. And we see all the way across Winrock Mountain, this primary big mountain here. It's best known for the Coal Creek Company, which has 400 miles of off-road trails for ATVs. So you'll see in Oak Ridge all these big ATVs going up and down the highway all day long. That's where they're going. I grew up there <laughs> and, and on all those trails. It's been a coal mining area, still an active coal mining area, since um, almost back to the Civil War. 
So then, Buffalo Mountain, if you can, if you have really good eyes right there between the two big trees, you'll see TVA wind turbines there. I see. There's 20 TVA wind turbines up there. Um, wow. That's called Bu the Buffalo oh, Mountain Wind Park uh, for TVA. And as we get close to our cars on Mississippi Road, we'll see the transmission line. So now we're back on the main trail. And you can just kind of see right now the leaves haven't come on the trees just yet. So it's very open. This trail's got a really good path and well marked so far. Louise? Yeah, wow. when we get down to the creeks, it's going to be real nice. Real? Here. So the, you'll see on a lot of the trails here in Oak Ridge, they ask you to like wipe your boots and uh, try to not that you evacuate. We're like in the early 60s in the Cold War, we would pack it with our family, grab the cat. You just, that's the way I grew up. You didn't know any difference. You, if, this, if the air raid siren went off any time other than 5 o'clock in the afternoon, you'd jump in the car as fast as you could and you drove out of town. You know, it's only like when you're about 15 you realize how scary that was. Oh my God. <laughs> you know. Colors together. Red and yellow. Trail cut to their house. Oh! So that way you, they know where to go. When you're kids, we had trails like this all over these woods, you know. That's yeah. probably somebody with kids that cuts those trails. Huh. You know, have an access path and build yeah. a Yeah. So he was like a little old school. Yeah. And he wouldn't tell the wife none of the money. That means there's usually a subterranean cave right underneath it where the wow. water goes. Wow. And you, you don't know how far down it is there <laughs> and how and how stable the structure is above it. So, so you don't want to build a hole. house on top of that. Do it by doing this, now it won't flood mm -hmm. the right. trail. Yeah. Yeah. If you didn't do that, then yeah. that's what washes the trail. Like in the Smokies, you yep. get those deep washed yep. trails. Wow. So like the Smokies you, has all What did you call this? A water, a water bar. Water, bar. water, bar. water, water bars. Water because it's usually like a stick right there. Yeah. You know, like in the Smokies. Yeah. yeah. Huh. Did not know that that's what that was called. That was brutal. That was tough. They might have taught their children unknowingly. Oak Ridge called the Tennessee Citizens for Wilderness Plan. Probably one of the best, if not the best, grassroots conservation um, organizations in, in the United States. So this was their first bit. They envisioned. It was amazing. I thought it was amazing. Now we're getting. I always love those. Now we're getting real. Those spots where the ferns are just. This. Parts of this trail are pretty steep for moments. They do. Beef is definitely on that list. Up and down on this trail. Maybe if you could take about 40 pictures here. It's Mayflowers. I think it may be. Steve uh, went high with his wife for a little bit, so show you a little bit of the trail as we're hiking. Because said uh, this is kind of an up and down trail for eight more miles, so it's not exactly an easy trail, it's rated hard. But there are some beautiful wildflowers and plants on this trail. You can see the red buds up ahead. All right, we're hiking on. All right, we're back up to up again. We got some stairs up here though. That's helpful, sometimes. <laughs> sometimes it makes it harder. These are helpful. Let's see how steep it is. And you hear about my breathing. Oh, look at all the trail, you whole patch out there. There's a ton through here. All right, so back right where we stopped, we just stopped, uh, there's a trail junction, and if you go straight, it's blue blazes, so you have to go right, and it's a white blaze. And then, oh, so we're going, heaven, we're going down now, yay! So good. Uh, it's what? The man, the flowers out here are amazing. I mean, that patch of trillium is just amazing. Wow. Really Loving it. It's a great trail. So if you go left, there's a yellow blaze. We're gonna go white, or, uh, right. <laughs> We're gonna go right to the white blaze. 
find you have insurance. They did, but when I switched to trail runners, it's uh, pretty green through here. And they'd be really sore Pretty cool. Right, it's the constant pounding on truck one rock. Yeah, we might. Yeah, just a tiny bit of a stream. I was gonna say she's a Jerry, big Jerry, walk for Jerry. Hiker. She reminds me of when I talk to Betsy. She can tell you everything she's passing. Yeah. Very impressed by you. Your knowledge. She's. Montana, Mississippi, Nebraska, Nebraska Wisconsin, <laughs> Oklahoma, <laughs> Oklahoma are, oh. yeah. are there any that are not represented? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's Oklahoma to Tennessee. So, so you know, it was, it was odd given directions growing up because you'd say you pass Louisiana, you pass Montana, you go up Nebraska, and people are like, what? Like, how long? <laughs> that that triple so this is a sycamore tree. Jenkins. Yeah. You could that tell because it gets wider as you go to the top. That is a gorgeous. Oh, it's beautiful. beautiful. Most sycamores are going to be within 10 feet of a creek. Huh. Unless you plant them yourself, then they'll do pretty good. But you'll notice the sycamores are within 10 feet, so their roots, they want their roots to get into the creek like that. And then you'll see the hardwoods after that. There's another double over there. Yeah. <clears throat> pretty hardwoods coming up. From the rocks. We all grew up with chiggers, didn't we? Yes, that was, yeah. <laughs> They're fingernail polish. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It's kind of your rock rib openings right there. Yeah. All kinds of little crevices in like there. Little mini caves. And here's your big holes in the rocks right here. What Ken was saying where the buzzards are. Oh, that ivy. That's so cool. These are pretty with the flowers in here. I know. Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, because there's uh, like ice cascade yeah. frozen on them. It's cool. Yeah. What kind of tree that is? I have no idea what kind of tree is it. Okay. Somebody uh, thinks this is the AT. <laughs> they left their shoes. They changed their shoes. <laughs> if that comes out, the whole rocks come down. Then they really would name the rock after you. See, this is why wow. we called them holy rocks. They had all these holes in them. <laughs> <laughs> They're really pretty. I, I love them like This favorite. is so cool. Look at the of them, you got flowers. Them Indians camp under them, you know? Okay, I gotta get them all. And I ain't gonna see if it's Oh, look. <laughs> There's fox, and I've seen toothwort. We have a big ranger on. Oh, so so really poppies. Pretty. What's your like, real name, Dr. John? Oh, my God. Are they wild, or is that like yes. somebody? Awesome. Pieces hanging off the bottom, yeah. and I don't see them yet, oh, so they're not yeah. developed so they yet. Yeah. So yeah. this is Solomon's seal. Mm -hmm. The trail to the back, uh -huh. way in the back, yeah. you'll come across a see, bunch is, of these. Lark, this is Larkspur. Like water. In here they yeah, have, look at those. They would not those have look that. Right. So, so do you know what checks. happened? You started getting headaches, or did you have a constant headache? Um, from your fall? I'm not sure about that. But I know there is something about a male female with the May apples. And now that's all part of the I don't know if you can tell in the video, but it's really pretty out there. Right. Oh my gosh. Okay, help yourself, Almond Joys. <gasps> Look at this. It's like trail magic. Look what Steve uh, got. Look what Steve got. A Diet Coke with a ladybug on it. <laughs> Diet Coke and Almond Joy. I feel like I'm on the trail. Yay. The best sound. To me, that is just the best feeling in the world. It's like, oh, it's yes. awesome. It has Yep, that makes oh, speaking of, I told you, you got to try this. Yes, indeedy. Jerry, thank you very Today's much, Today's lunch is peanut butter and jelly. Secret City Trekker Patch. 
So when I did that about a month ago, they told me I was the first person to do it in three years. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> it's their cool little pack. Well, we can get today for hiking the day. Mm -hmm. And then this one. Oh, yeah, look at that. I need to put my 900 miler on my pack and hike the Smokies. All right, we're starting back out after our lunch break. And it's straight up. Whew. And this is kind of rough. Like, wow. This is like Jake and Ridge rough. Okay, what's that? That. No, go ahead. I'm just video. I'm just videoing. That's cool. I'm take it from both sides. See which Ouch. one you can tell. Yeah, better. which one looks looks nicer? You go ahead. How cool is that? Yeah, very cool. Yeah, I'll swap them. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> All these rocks that are here. This trail just got so much cool stuff on it. I mean, the amount of wildflowers and the all these like really cool rocks and stuff. I mean, man, this trail is awesome. Now this part looks a little more smoky mountain. Yeah. Gonna say this, uh, Rips them off the rock. Yeah. <laughs> Switch it to video. <laughs> well, I got it on video, so. All right. They get millions of views. <laughs> Just kidding. That would be the viral. Uh, that would be terrible. <laughs> I want to be like. This little spot right here is called Little Maccabee. You'll have to send <laughs> See, it kind of looks like Little Maccabee. See. Ha, ha. He's Jerry. a thousand Jerry's feet standing in the air. there. Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. There's a house up there. One of the spins of homes. Great. Super slippery. You can see the poppies everywhere. Yeah, we came from oh my gosh, look at this way, thing. way up there. I'm wore out. Yeah, this is the kind of stuff we're hiking up. Just straight up. Straight up that way. Over here on the right of the trail, the highway. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but we're luckily going down right now. That up, ooh. That up is brutal for me, especially when it's warm. Loved it because I didn't have to change lenses and it was fantastic. But it was a lens. Kind of opened up like this really open spot here. Oh, wow, look how pretty that is. Wow. Look this fresh. Fresh. Here it's a lot of briars. I 
to like 180 or something. <laughs> Finally, have some down. Where they're going up, and I'm just gonna tell you, I'm having a rough time right now. Um, I don't know. I'm, I am really just not the fastest hiker. I mean, I'll probably average about a two-mile pace. You know, I mean, with, even with taking video and pictures, but every once in a while, I can get in maybe two and a half, three if I'm just like going down and really booking it but honestly I'm just not a fast hiker and I don't care but right now I'm a slow hiker I don't know I'm just the heat it's like 70 something degrees I mean it's killing me so yeah I'm in the bag right now which is fine but just, I don't know Makes me feel like I'm out of shape or something, but I don't know. I guess I'd be, I mean, I just hike once a week and it's just not enough. I don't know. I haven't been feeling like this. I think it's just the heat. I am way overdressed. Got leggings on, it's just shorts. Anyway, just keeping it real. <laughs> keeping it real. This over coming to a road. Uh, now we get to hike on a road. Quite honestly, it's quite, hopefully for a little bit, because it's kind of, kind of nice. It's, I don't have to think about my feet. I can just walk. So, he just killing me. We did try that. I started to film the dead rabbit back there on the road and say, did anybody want some rabbit stew? But I thought that wasn't very nice to gross out my viewers. So, I didn't feel it. It was pretty disgusting actually. Ugh. Okay, I'm telling you, I'm walking, hiking on the road right now. Ooh, I mean, I am not gonna complain about heat. I'm not, cause you know, I said when it was cold, I was ready for it to be warm. <sighs> Gonna have to give me some shorts though. <sighs> because, <sighs> yeah, I'm not used to heat. And that wasn't exactly an easy trail either. <laughs> it was kind of hard. Just saying. So if you think we can come out Oak Ridge and hike, and it just be a little like stroll in the park, not on that trail. <laughs> Unless you only do like maybe a mile or so. But it's still a very nice trail. Just expect to work the booty a little. Well, we can run the heat. You. No, I'm okay. All right. I'll be okay. Really, the next mile and a half is probably the easiest to the whole trail. Oh, okay, that's perfect. So perfect's once we good. get to that green uh, sign, I'm going to run ahead and try to catch Linda. Okay. Hey, there's our green sign. Oh, Lord. <laughs> crossing the crossing the highway. Don't want to get killed. Whew. There's the oh great sign up there. <laughs> Illinois 70. So all the trails you see around here are named after states. <sighs> Alright, so this is the easiest of the whole trail. <laughs> Let's hope. Oh, 
Oh, look at the. Look, it's actually a redbud tree. It's found. It's crazy because almost all of the what are called the hard trails and the Smokies, the, I've hiked them up. I'm not saying those were easy to hike up. I don't know, I just feel like at this point I should be in better shape for this. I mean, granted, I was sick with vertigo for an entire week. Probably should be out right now, honestly. Probably should have been resting. Well, guess what I'm doing when I get home? Resting, and guess what I'm gonna do tomorrow? Rest all day, lay around the couch like a vegetable. Look, I've got my ride. Tire's missing. Well, that's weird. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys at the bottom. Drag it out. Here you'll see some historic relics from the area. A tire. A big wheel. Heart. <laughs> oh lord. All right, we are almost done. We're hiking on an old evacuation route, which is a road that people in Oak Ridge would take when they had like uh, threats of bomb threats and stuff. I mean, we're almost done. We're almost done. You want to put a privacy and a view in Oak Ridge. <laughs> yeah. That's beautiful view. Oh, we are finally done. I'm so happy. So happy to be done. Oh, Lord. Oh, All right, we are back to our car, and I am actually feeling a lot better now. Uh, I kind of cramped up there towards the end of the hike. Uh, so, I don't know. I guess uh, I think it was dehydrated, so which is we explained the cramping, and I was also feeling dehydrated. nauseous. But Cynthia was really sweet. She poured like water all over my the back of my head, all over, and it's already dry. Like that's yeah, it's pretty bad. Anyway, I need to be better about more diligent. I, I mean, I thought I was drinking enough water, but I don't know. I shouldn't. Uh, I, I did, I guess. Anyway, but it was such a great hike today. I mean, all the people that hiked. We're on our hike today. We're just just super awesome hikers. Just the nicest people you'll ever meet. They were just so awesome. So we really really enjoyed the they hike today. I was it was a great hike. It was really nice meeting That's some really nice all of you. The ones I didn't know we did know, and so it's a, those are the kind of hikes you really enjoy going on. You know, especially the big hikes where there's a lot of people. So anyway. We're starving, so we're going to go to Big Ed's <laughs> and have time pizza. Again, since we're in Oak Ridge. So, headed that way now. So we'll take you along with us, so you can see the yummy, yummy, delicious pizza. Okay, I don't know what that is, but look at that crap. Not crap, but look at that. That's pretty cool. I earned this. Look at that yummy goodness. Mm. Okay, I had to stop <laughs> on the side of the road 